Hi there, um, a little video about the pads this time. Um, once again, this doesn't just relate to the 5X. The principle is the same on the other models, the PA4X, PA1000, PA700. Some of the pads may be different, but the principle of what I'm talking about remains the same. Now, pads we usually use to enhance a style. What I'm going to do is use a part of a style to enhance the pads. So I'm going to turn it round the opposite way. Uh, let me see if I can explain to you. The style that I've chosen to use for this demo is 12-8 Ballad. And if we go into our mixer and we make sure we're on the style tab, let me unmute everything for a second. So I'm just going to play you uh, the style. I'm only going to use it on variation one. And this is what it what it gives us. A really nice 12-8 ballad, but I don't want the drums. So I'm going to go to the drum uh, column and I'm going to mute that. I don't want that German dry grand piano. I'm going to take that out. I definitely want the bass because that's one element I'm looking for. Do I want that steel guitar? Let me just have a listen. So all we're hearing at the moment then will be bass and steel guitar. I could mute the other sections, but I've already checked they're not being used in variation one. So no need to, but just belt and braces. Let's let's mute those as well. Yeah. You know, I, I quite like what that steel guitar is doing. Um, I'm going to leave that in. So we've stripped our style right back. Now I need to look at my pads that I'm going to use as the main part of the style, just backed up by the bass and the steel guitar. So I'm going to go back to my keys and I will show you the three primary pads that I'm going to use. In pad one, I've put 6-8 electric guitar arpeggio one. And that's in the electric guitar bank, page one, on the second column there. Uh, if you want to have a listen to that. Really nice electric guitar sound with a, with a little bit of effect on. In pad two, I put strings. And that's in the orchestra bank, and it's actually the very first option on page one. And that sounds like this. So it's a chord-based string harmony, basically. Um, let's put the two together. So you're now going to hear the electric guitar and the strings. Right, we're now starting to form the basis of a style, actually. Um, let's, let's do one more. In pad three, I've put 6-8 steel guitar arpeggio, which is in the acoustic guitar bank, page four, at the bottom of the page in the, in the second column. Like I say, if your keyboard doesn't have these exact pads, um, then find some alternatives. Now, 6-8 you will always be able to blend with a 12-8, but some of the others which are in 4-4 four, four, uh, time certainly won't work with the bass line that we're using from a 12-8 rhythm. Um, so you've got to be a little bit careful, but let's exit back out of there. So we've got our three pads. Let's hear all three together. you know what that's really nice and we could if we wanted just play to that so let's use all three pads nothing else at the moment And it sounds nice. I could, I could balance it up a little bit better. So if we go into our keyboard and pad sliders here, 
I'll probably bring the, the strings down a little bit. They were a little bit dominant. Now, how about we add our bass out of that uh, style? Because to be honest, that's the only bit that I really felt was missing. Um, now, what will happen is that the pads automatically sync with the tempo of the rhythm. So what we could do is put the synchro start on and we'll do our three pads. Now you can hear that electric bass from the style. There is a, another little bit of acoustic guitar, but it's just blending in nicely with the pads. So let's just stop for a second and think what we've done. We've used the pads as the style and just filled it out with mainly the bass line from one of the factory styles. Nine cases out of 10, we would probably do it the other way around. We would use a style and enhance that a little bit by using the pads. But this is a great and an interesting way to use them. So all I'm gonna to do to finish this is just play a little bit using the pads and the bass line taken from our 12-8 ballad. So we've got synchro start on, gonna start the pads like this. There you go. So that's using the pads as a style, but just enhancing it with the bass line taken from one of the factory styles. Hope you enjoyed that and I'll see you on the next video.